And they're, uh, everybody's taking uh, advantage of the place and going on a ride before they do our show. That's right. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't yes. frighten any of you, did we? Nah, but we made a little bit. And Nick <laughs> sit together. So yeah. Let, let's yeah, we begin felt a little now. odd. Together 12 years, and when did it begin? Well, actually, uh, we just celebrated 12 years. Uh, April 20th of 1993 is when we got together. Uh -huh. So, um, actually, I was in Lexington, Kentucky, and my cousin Kevin, Kevin and I are first cousins, he called me April 19th, and I flew to Orlando April 20th, and it's been together ever since. And that's where it started, in Orlando, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. So now, but we haven't heard too much of about you yeah, or from you. Yeah, we just thought that you guys broke up. Yeah, but I did. I didn't know. No? But what have you been up to? What have you been doing? Well, um, we all took a well, a well needed break. Uh -huh. We were a little fried after the last tour. <laughs> we were kind of taking... Did he say fried? Fried. Yeah. Yeah. We were, we're fried right now, too. <laughs> um, <laughs> and uh, we, we, we were just taking each other for granted. We were taking the business for granted. We just needed a well-deserved break. and. Mm -hmm. During the break, uh, Nick, I'll, I'll just go down the line. Nick was doing a solo tour and a solo album as well as working on some acting and stuff. Um, I, uh, I was busy working on my sobriety, working on myself. I have a little over two and a half years now sober. And how, you doing that, now? how you doing now? I'm doing great. I'm Very doing, I'm doing awesome. My life has changed for nothing but the better. Great. Um, and I thank you for all your support. Thank you. Um, Howie was, uh, we all call Howie Trump Jr. because he's making some really good investments in real estate lately, as well as working on a, on a Spanglish album, solo album, as well as doing some acting. Oh, that's great. Kevin, as you know, uh, was doing Broadway both on the West End in London as well as in uh -huh. uh, New York. Mm -hmm. And he also just uh, co-produced a soundtrack to an independent film that'll be coming out this summer uh, called Rise that David LaChapelle directed. And uh, last but not least, Brian, uh, he's a new father now, a two and a half year old little boy, Barry. Yeah, we met the little baby about a year ago. And, uh, and he's also uh, going to be releasing a pop gospel album this uh, coming fall. Wow, oh, so you guys have been doing a lot. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. absolutely. But here's the new, the new CD exactly. that's coming out next month. We're yeah. so proud of it. And uh, how long did it take to make this one? This album actually took a lot longer than um, our past albums. I think we. We knew how critical it was to get into the studio and make the best album of our careers. And uh, we took about a year and five months to do this. No kidding, a year and, and five months. And, um, you know, music has changed and we realized that. But um, we just kind of wanted to go in there and do something different and new and fresh and something that we've all been proud of. You know, it kind of started off a little bit urban, a little um, R&B in the beginning. And then we got back together with Max Martin, our original producer. And now he's written like four, four songs on the record. And it's now turned into this kind of pop rock, more alongside the pop end, but um, it's, it's great. We're very proud of it. Did you hear one of the contestants on American Idol sing your song this week? Yeah, Any actually. About it. Yeah, my brother called me from Florida, since yeah. we're all now residing here in, in Los Angeles area, since we've been working on the album for the last year. And he uh, called me up earlier, like about three hours earlier, and said, you got to watch American Idol. They're you actually incomplete being sung. Uh -huh. and I was like, oh. I, actually, I was actually surprised. Like, I was surprised that Simon didn't <laughs> say anything bad about it. But, uh, <laughs> well, Simon's a big fan of yours. Yeah. We just asked him right here. He's an awesome yeah. guy. Well, how did Anthony do? Does it make you cringe when other people sing your songs? <laughs> I, I haven't heard it, so I can't right. attest to that. Has anybody heard it? I, I can heard just it. say it's, it's definitely, I would, uh, my hat's off to anybody, especially as a solo artist who tries to sing a song that we do five part harmony. Yeah, right. that sure. would That's be a definitely a challenge. One, it's you? a compliment, though, that they would pick your song in the At first solo. Yeah, 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 Anytime awesome. they do your song, it's a compliment. You're right. So now, you know, they, they, they're touring around the country in, in smaller clubs, and now you're right. going out on a big tour this summer, huh? Yeah, we How did uh, the, uh, the little tour circuit go? I know you played in New York City, Irving yes. Plaza. Yes, we did yeah. uh, two sold out nights in Irving Plaza. And. Uh -huh. um, it, actually, the, the small tour that we did was actually fabulous. The mm -hmm. response was amazing. Um, the, the fans are getting a little older, and we're also uh, having the younger, younger siblings sure. of we're the fans We're not getting older. In. No, we're not getting older. Just None us, of us. <laughs> Make you feel good to know that, gee, they still remember you so well. And it was great, great to fun. reconnect with our fans, and yeah. that's the whole purpose of it, was to reconnect in a small atmosphere, in a small venue, sure. just to get up and close. And it Does it great. just sort of get you back in shape, too, for those bigger Absolutely. arenas? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Because, because in a chop. smaller audience, you're actually more vulnerable, I feel like, than you are in a bigger audience. Yeah. 
know what you mean. We actually threw AJ in the audience. Yeah, I, I AJ got the crowd. Something we've never done before. Oh, really? It was <laughs> awesome. awesome. <laughs> a rock and roll group. <laughs> it was fun. I don't know hey, if I'll do it again. We've got but... uh, your brother on. Nick, we've got Aaron Carter yeah, on Aaron's tomorrow. Yeah, Aaron's coming on tomorrow. I'm sorry, I'm so far away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, Aaron's yeah. going to come on tomorrow That's down awesome. in uh, down in Florida. Excellent. Well, anyway, guys, uh, it's great to have you back. It really is on CD. Thank you. It's on June 17th, 14th. Never Gone is the name of it. We thank you very much for being with us. Great to have you back. Thanks for making us the first show. Thank you. Thank you.